as thunderstruck rings out across the ground here at the Veneto Club. Welcome to NPLW Victoria for what should hopefully be a thunderous contest on this Monday evening. Now Janczewski on the ball and she's going to put a shot in. And it just flashes wide there. And now we'll be keeping an eye on Vlanic as she's got a bit of space to operate in on this left flank. And players arriving as well. It's over the top. Charge down through on goal. Can she finish, Eliana? She'll cut it back instead. Players were arriving, but Calder just able to survive there in the end, Marissa Lean. Every player on the edge of the penalty area. And now the run's come. Really into the middle of there. It's fallen at the back post. Morrison saved. The onrushing run of Grace Taranto is rewarded, but unable to get anything from it. Eliadis applying the pressure to Deloste. And now the turnover here. Eliadis offside. It's coming back, unfortunately. See Morrison getting up there. Has had a couple of chances from set pieces in the first half. High ball in. Falls to the back post. Janczewski. One touch, two touch, three touch saved from Deloste. What about that? Really keeping her side in it. But now Taranto getting forward and Withers. Is this the opening that Calder needs? Shot comes in and it's going to flash across the face of goal. Cube. If you are high, Tony. But that one's coming through now. Privatelli's in space. She's got pace. Privatelli shot. Top corner of the net. And that is the opening goal of the game. Liver, Leah Privatelli so lethal in space. Top corner. Deloste, no saving that one. That was absolutely sensational from Leah Privatelli. We've been talking about all these championship players from Victory. We probably not mention Leah Privatelli. Absolutely lethal with her pace. Did not look at any other defenders. Was so focused on the goal. One arm up, Barbieri. It was bending. It was bending, but just not far enough. Whipped in. Eliadis at the back post. Crucially important intervention by Sada. That would have been two. Doran watches it as she plays it back, and there's a lot of time now for this ball to get whipped in. Eliadis again, and that's the second. Now she gets it, nodded on towards the back post. Daloste dived, unable to make it in time. Look at them get around the ball in, up and about. They take a two-goal lead, and you'd have to say it's deserved. This ball is whipped in. Pack of players. Privatelli it was nodded on, but it's going to get sent back in. Withers, Adriana Taranto. A Taranto. And there's the first save of the game for Gabby Garten at the back and won it. Now Sinclair, ball in behind for Withers. She's got Zimmerman arriving if she wants it, but instead she goes for goal herself. Just under six minutes of regulation remaining. If Calder want to get something from this game, they have to strike quickly. Ball is whipped in now, and that's going to be bundled in. And it's 3-0 for Boleyn. Just when we're speculating on if Calder can somehow find a way back into this. Bulleen make it three. The dagger driven through the hearts of Calder. And you'd have to say, Marissa, perhaps game over. But however, that back pass from Morrison sold Garten into a bit of trouble, especially with the speed of Withers. And there is the final whistle. Full time here at the Veneto Club. Leah Privatelli delivering an absolute pile driver to open the scoring. And then Tiffany Eliadis adding a brace of her own to make it 3-0 and put the game out of sight.